There are two ways to move your captured scans into scene process. For scans on an SD card within the Freestyle 3D, plug the SD card into a laptop and open scene process. You will be prompted to import scans. Users may manually move the images from an SD card into scene process file folder. The first tool to click is the process command. This will process all scans brought into scene process. There are two cupboard scans captured in the last video. The first scan is 530 frames. I am going to pause the video here and wait for the process to be completed for both scans. The processing of images is now complete. The timing of this process was approximately 5 minutes. In the upper left corner of the screen, the process command is green, signifying processing is complete. Once the scans have been processed, create a rotational point by clicking Rotational Point command and set a point to rotate the scan. You may also use the controls on the left and the right of the screen to rotate the scan. Another option for changing the view of our scan is the Level tool. To level our scan, click the Leveling tool and click three points on the ground within the scanned image to advise the scene process of the ground location within the scan. The next tool is the Split command. The Split command can be used to separate a scan into different parts. To use this tool, click the Scan to Split and click on the Split command. This changes the view of the scan and brings up the split option. The slider bar shows where the split will occur determined by green tint. Once you have decided where you would like to split the scan, you can confirm by clicking on the scissors on the right of the screen. Now we're going to register, or join our scans, to form a single scan of both images. Click the cupboard cluster and click the place command. This will bring up a new screen with both scans. An option of discarding any scans that we do not need will appear. Once all images are clicked, click Next Step to move on in the process. This will load both scans into the main page. Note any markers in each image. I applied these to the cupboard and picked them up in my scan to help in registering the images. In the bottom right of the image, the program has automatically picked up on three markers, which is called correspondence. Correspondences are used to register the two images together to create one unified scan. You can also add correspondences manually, which can be completed with the option Scan Points, Spheres, Checkerboards, or Planes. Using the Sphere correspondence, click the sphere located in both images. The correspondence point has registered in the bottom right of the screen, showing four correspondence points. Click Next Step and the images will be joined. Verify the placement of the images by clicking Yes or re-register the images by clicking No.